Oh, there it is. Bond, 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 bonds. And how many? It just requires extra bond bonds. Of course it would, because that's all it is. It's more bond bonds than just bond bonds. It's bond, bond, bond bonds. And we're going to make one of those. Howdy, partner. Welcome back to Starbound Alpha Nightly Dev Test Fancy Majorgan Thingamajig. Or something like that. <laughs> Yahoo. <laughs> Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Starbound. This is indeed the latest nightly build, and apparently we're getting mighty close to the next stable official update that's going to uh, include all of the nightly updates all rolled into one, and then we'll have a semi-stable alpha build, or early access build, to play around with, although the game's not going to be complete then. Um, I don't have any clue when the game is going to be officially released as version 1, for example, but uh, at least that stable branch should be coming down the pike pretty darn soon. But I thought it might be fun to take a look at some of the new stuff here because there has been quite a few new things added, and I have been playing a little bit. The problem with playing this game with the, uh, the nightly builds is that you get wiped out a lot. They wipe out your whole character and your ship and everything, so um, it's very hard to make any progress. But I have played a little bit today and some last night and it hasn't been updated yet, or at least not wiped. So I figured, uh, let's take a quick peek. So first and foremost, you will note that I am a cowgirl. This is actually a girl. She's a Nova kid. And you can see her up here at Silkeen. That's her name up there. And uh, she's, yeah, one of the new Nova kid races. And she's kind of, this is kind of a cowboy theme-ish. Or space cowgirl theme or something. You can see I'm driving a... Um, my spaceship is actually a locomotive. <laughs> but it's busted right now. Actually, I did fix it somewhat, but the FTL drive still needs to be fixed. So we can go talk to Sale. Which is now a horse! Hell, hello, Ed! <laughs> uh, and he says the ship's FTL drive is now fully functioning. Alright, now I did fix it, we just don't have any fuel for it. So if you go over here to the fuel box... We can't use coal anymore. If you guys recall, we used to be able to put coal in here. Coal is no longer a fuel. Uh, we have a special fuel to get. If you go to quests, you can see it right here. We need this liquid Erceus. So we've got to go down into a planet surface and and suck some of that up with our new improved matter manipulator. So these are all this is all just new stuff. It's really cool. So I like that change. Uh, the the neat thing is though, even though our FTL drive is working and we don't have any fuel, we can still move around this system. We just can't. We just can't leave the system and get off out into this bigger galaxy. But we can. We can stay. We can go. Whoop! Is that the right one? Yeah. Yeah. This is my gate. It's one with the little red marker there, um, and that's my home planet, which we're not currently orbiting. We are now orbiting this planet. I think I'm orbiting orbiting this planet. Let's find out. No, no, we're not. So right now we're going to head over to this uh, forest planet because I have a quest, and we can do this while I fly, or something. Yeah. Don't do this. Don't look at your phone while driving. So here we are, a fair trade. I got this at the outpost. And we're gonna go try this right now. I need to find coffee beans and make some coffee. So there's a coffee machine in town. I just have to go find some coffee on the planet. It will bring that back, and then we'll get our first um, our first reward from her anyway, which is a blank tech card. And we can use that tech card over here. Hello, Ed. Her her. Uh, <laughs> I gotta work on my horse voice. But these are the old texts that we used to find. You used to find these recipes laying around, right? And then you just threw them in the tech thing, and you could assign one to your body. But now you actually have to find these blank tech cards, and these are already here. So I imagine we're still going to find new recipes because there's a lot more than just these. And I have three available. So we have Bouncy, and we have uh, Body. Energy Dash is the one I'm really looking forward to because that's the one that moves around fast. And then you can unlock the tech when you find that blank tech card. So... That is what we're going to try to do today. And check this out. We have butterfly nets now. And I caught these two little butterflies. So they fly around now uh, down on the planet surfaces. And you can just swing at them with your, your butterfly net. And you'll snag them. And there's, right now there's only two different kinds that I've found so far. But that's going to be fun to kind of sort of try to collect all those guys. Oh, there's a big deal with foods now too. I wanted to make this before we go down. So I found some corn and some pearl peas and this stuff. Rice down on, a, on my first planet. And uh, so now there's a whole new system for making foods and using foods to buff yourself. So not only do the foods... Oh, look at this. Learn to craft pearl pea broth. Now that I've made that pearl pea, boiled pearl, pearl peas, I can make the broth too. 
which shows up as a recipe. So that's pretty cool. Sometimes you'll see that little thing pop up down there. It says, hey, you learned a new recipe just as you're out walking around uh, finding new things. And the recipes get added automatically to your, your uh, little workbenches here. Look at this. That looks beautiful. Rice and peas together. Mmm. Nom nom. So now, not only do they look good, but they taste good too, and they give you some sort of buff. So I haven't tried this yet, but here's my corn on the cob. And I'm not even sure if this is actually fully functioning yet, but oh, there's my pearl pea thingy. Why don't we eat one and see what it does? This veggie soup I actually bought in town um, from a vendor. Here, let's eat that. And we get a little buff up here. And the food will restore health, which is nice over time. You can see it dropping slowly. And I think that means we are currently well fed. So that prevents you from spamming all these foods and getting their buffs. So there's no, there's no buff apparently with that piece of food that I just ate. Other than the, uh, the health. Wow! Hi! Mushroom guy! I've never been here before. But hold on. I'm sorry. I don't mean to point my gun at you. Here, let's do this instead. Okay, I need to talk. Um, so there will be other buffs here as well. Like if we tried a different piece of food, but we can't spam it, like I said. So that's going to prevent us from eating. Hi! <laughs> I love this game. You just, they just throw these little interesting curveballs at you. You just don't expect it. Let's just turn the music down just a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. Down 30 ought to be good. So you are stuck. There's a mushroom guy. He's got a sword. I think he wants to hit me. This is not very nice. Let's find out. I have a gun, you know. Maybe he doesn't want to hit me. No, he doesn't want to hit me. He doesn't want to talk to me either. He's afraid of my gun. You don't say much or do much, do you? But I like your house. Um, I might just take a few things, if you don't mind. I don't think he minds too much. Oh, there's a chest out there. Oh, did you hear that? My, I just ran out of energy. So now your weapons... Oh, here he comes. Maybe he doesn't like this at all. I'm sorry. Just stay back. Stay back. And my gun wasn't loaded, but he doesn't know that. Okay. Here you go now. Get out. I'm moving in. <laughs> it's a mushroom house. I love it. I'm going to take some of that mushroom too. Uh, so now your energy works a little differently. So you can fire as many times as you want until your energy runs out. That hasn't changed. Whoops. Like the, Oh, well, that's a bad guy. Hmm. And we'll just shoot at him a little bit. And now you see my energy goes all the way down. It's not coming back until I stop shooting. And now I can't shoot at all because the energy's gone. I'm trying to shoot right now, but you can see my bar slowly filling up. And I can't until it comes back all the way. Kind of cool. So now you have to be a little more strategic, Marie. You have to use a little more strategic, Marie. When you're in fighting, when you're, when you're, when you're combating. And I think the combat is supposed to be a little bit more interactive in that respect. You have to think a bit more. Here we go. I learned to craft mushroom bread and mushroom block with that mushroom I just picked up. So another, uh, looks like a couple more food recipes. I want to shoot him so badly. He's freaking me out with the hair and the not talking. But I'm going to check out this mushroom chest. <laughs> I love it. Uh, guys, I've been waiting so long for this game to come back. Oh, look, a recipe. It's a blueprint. Oh, I just got that anyway. Isn't that interesting how it's here, too, right next to the mushroom guy? Mushroom block crafting schematic. But anyway, so yeah, the Nova kids are kind of like space cowboys and girls. And so you start out with these guns. And when you craft new weapons and clothing, this is what you get. Sort of spacey deputy wild, wild west type theme. All right, let's go see who's friendly and who's not. My rifle's pretty powerful. Whoa! Dude. Okay. She's not friendly. The little Pokemon. This guy doesn't look friendly either. He's coming right for me. I'm going to shoot right over this other little fella. Uh-oh. I have no energy. I wait for it to come back. I can always hit it with my weapon, my melee. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me, was that you? Look at sugar cane. I can make bonbons, candied corn, and pearl pea jam. How cool is that? It's timber, watch out, mushroom people! You know, let me go find some coffee. Then we'll head over back. We'll head to the town. Oh, look it! It's a shroom chair blueprint. So apparently. Some of the things you find here in these biome, in these uh, little villages, are indeed high. Are indeed sort of themed for the area. Boom! More mushroom guys. These must be the guardians. They look very angry all the time. Super serious. Why so serious, man? Oh, hey guys, check it out. This is a new butterfly. I don't think I have a red variety of butterfly. Let's snag him. 
Ready? Whoop, got him. Check him out. Where is he? Oh, here he is. It's a red wing bug. So they're not all butterflies, I guess, but they are various types of bugs. Isn't that cool? Its wings shimmer like flame. And this one, its tawny wings make it hard to spot on trees. Love it. Love it. All right, I'm going to continue my quest for the coffee beans. Oh, oh, I didn't know what that was. And I walked up and I harvested it. And look, coffee beans, coffee seed, and plant fibers. Darn, you guys just missed it. I'm sorry. Let's go see if we can find another one. I, oh, I caught a, a blue bug too, by the way. Just like this little fella. What is he? Whoops. Put him back down. It's a blue back bug. This blue bug has sharp little teeth. It's worth 800 coins. It seems like an awful lot, doesn't it? Oh, here we go. It's a tomato. It's a tomato. Or, or tomato. Learn to craft tomato juice. I can make tomato juice, Mr. Bird. Okay, guys, we're back up on the locomotive, and I want to see my new cooking recipes. We have meat dumplings, which is cooked steak and wheat. Sounds delicious and probably extremely filling and high in protein. And carbs, maybe. And we have, oh, the pearl pea, pea jam. Tomato juice. Oh, bonbons. Oh, yeah. Confectionery perfection. Let's have some bonbons. And now that I've made the bonbons, that opens up sweet popcorn, bonbon, bonbons, and cake. <laughs> Let's see if they're in here. Oh, there it is, bon, 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 bonbons. And how many, it just requires extra bonbons. Of course it would, because that's all it is. It's more bonbons than just bonbons. It's bon, bon, bonbons. And we're going to make one of those. Ooh, that ought to satisfy my sweet tooth. I'm curious about this uh, meat dumpling. Mmm, we can make a meat stew now. So I think that demonstrates the, uh, the improved and much enhanced food system here and the cooking system. So I'm going to go ahead and eat these bonbons and we'll be on our way. Now I have some sort of a buff here. It looks like a speed buff. Oh yeah, I'm not running. Well, I am, but I'm not, I'm not holding down any special run key. I like how these slowly dissipate. So it looks like there's about maybe a minute for these two buffs. So that's the speed buff and the health buff. It looks like those foods buff about a minute and the, uh, we're still very hungry, uh, still full, so we can't eat any more right now until uh, we get hungry again, which makes sense. So I like that. I like that little um, visual cue there. Okay, let's get back to the outpost. Oh, wait a minute. Yep, that's the outpost we want to go to. I'm going to select it. Learned that the hard way in the last episode. Took me about 20 minutes to figure that out. And here's the town right over here. This is your outpost. You can interact with some of these places. So this one sells some random items. Soda and chocolate. In fact, I might buy some chocolate. I do have a sweet tooth after all. Medical kit sounds awesome. Oh, and here's the liquid. Oh, look, we can actually buy the liquid Urkeus instead of having to go out and find it. A dangerous and volatile isotope commonly used as starship fuel. It's expensive. Hey, quest complete. Huzzah, I've got the fuel I need. I can load it into the ship at the ship's fuel gauge, then use a navigator to take me to another nearby star system. Now we could leave the system. Very expensive though, 500, but it was worth it. I got the quest and I can dump that into the uh, fuel tank and we can move on. But before we go, we have to go do this quest. Where's, where's my girl? Oh, actually, I have to find the... Um, I'm going to make the coffee, don't we? I thought your head was the coffee machine. <laughs> Here, let's try... He's like, what? No comment. That's what that was. No comment. This looks like a coffee machine. Oh, man. We're going to make coffee in Starbound. <gasps> coffee. It's, it's nice, warm coffee. It's just a drop of coffee. Learned to craft flat white coffee. Now, what does that mean? I have to go put it in a cup. Oh, there she is. Hello. Excuse me. Oh, have a seat. We must chat. Here's your coffee. 
Thanks for the coffee, but I'm not drinking it straight out of your matter manipulator. You'll need to do better than that for a tech card. What? Talk to me again when you're not busy. Then she turns her back on me. Hey, we ladies have to stick together. This will get her attention. Ma'am, turn around. <laughs> See, it works every time. Guns do the talking. Here's the quest. If you do, if you go to a desert planet and make me a glass mug out of heated sand, I might actually be able to drink that coffee you gave me. Maybe then I'll give you the tech card. Oh, that's that wasn't part of the bargain, ma'am. I've been hornswoggled, is what that's called. Back where I come from, swaggled, horned. So I think what I'm going to do is go find a desert planet, planet, and um, give this girl her coffee. Properly. You can't just hand her a drop of coffee. It's in my matter manipulator. Did she take it? She took my coffee. She took it anyway, didn't she? Yeah. Dang fool city folk. Oh, my liquid. Yeah, my, my fuel. It is the jet fuel, essentially. Let's drop some of this in here. It's dangerous and volatile. Careful. Here we go. And we add it to the fuel like that. And it's gone. <laughs> and it's gone. It's supposed to... Oh, no, it's not. Okay, this is 20. Uh, I thought maybe it would show up in this meter. But maybe that, that did so little that it's not even going to show up in the meter. But you can see it there in the, uh, the number value. But I just got attacked by some crazy little toad. It was rabbit, I tell you. Bit me nearly in half. I got my health coming back slowly because I just ate some corn on the cob. And that felt right. But I think I need a bonbon to really motor. Is this a bonbon? Just a bonbon, regular bonbon. Oh, I can't eat because I'm full. <laughs> oh, no, that was the whole point that I was explaining earlier. Ow! Oh, I can't even hit you with a bug net? I'm sorry. It's just a bug net. I barely touched you with it. So now you made me shoot you. Now look at you. Now you're dead. Hope you're happy. Sun skipper bug. This pretty bug loves sunshine. I bet it does because we are now on the desert planet, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that. I was so surprised by getting attacked by that little crazy toad. But yeah, so now I'm trying to get the sand. Oh, there's one of those crazy toads. Not the big guy. The guy behind him, I think. And, oh, what's that with the hands? Giving up? Give up already? I didn't even draw my gun. Okay, go ahead. Put your hands up. Come on! Put your hands up toward the sky, and I won't shoot. Raise them up. Let's see the palms. Nope. Too late. I got a really nice... Uh, Weapon out of that chest right there. This thing does 166 damage. Is this a crazy toad? Hey. You no, know, no, same guy. Wonk. 227. Let's see some crazy toads. Watch this. Whoa, there he is. I told you. Leaping lizards. That's what he is. It's a leaping lizard, I think. <laughs> Did you see him fly? Oh, ma'am. Please step away from the bug. Thank you. It's a gold duck bug. Gold duck? That's a Pokemon, isn't it? Gold, oh, gold buck. A bug with glistening gold wings. Fancy. Oh, I like it. I'm up to six bugs. Six different kinds of bugs. Fantastic. Maybe I just need to have the ingredient on me. Bricks. Glass block. Yeah, there it is right here. It's in the uh, stone furnace. You don't have to cook anything. Just having the ingredient in your backpack allows you to craft it. I should have known better. I'm sure I've made glass before. Oh, wow, look at it. all the recipes just opened up. Glass coffee mug. Huzzah. Medical syringe and an empty bottle. Make a few more of those. And empty bottle. I needed my mug. All right, let's try that again. I'm back with my glass. Type in coffee. Our cough ought to do. And there's my coffee mug. That takes a lot of glass to make one mug. How big is this thing? Is she going to be able to hold it? Look at it. Oh, it's so cute. You can see right through it, too. <laughs> That's great. I want two of them, but I don't have enough glass. So I'm going to have to give this one away. Not crazy about that, I'll tell you. All right. I'm going to go finish this quest. All right, we're back at the outpost. There's a new sheriff in town, everybody. And he's got his glass mug. He's going to hand it off to the young lady here. Fill her up. Mmm, coffee. I really need to stir it before I'm satisfied, though. Talk to me again when you're... No. Uh, no, 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 no! no. Mmm, mmm, mmm! That's it, girl. Sit down. 
Well, it's time to have a heart to heart. Will you marry me? Wait a minute. No. Stirred, not shaken. If you get some steel and forge a stirring spoon for me, the drink will be perfect. Crafted on a metal workstation, and I'll surely give you the blank tech card. <laughs> Would you stop it with this? This is a typical games that. Who? What are you anyway? The Florin. Who? What are you? Human. Human women like to play. Now see what she's doing here to me. Give me the runaround. That's what they call that. Hog swoggled, swishbackled, run around, ma'am. And I'm not too fond of it. So now I have to make a metal workstation. So, that, so this is all just to demonstrate the progression through the quests and uh, showing you guys as new players how to make things. So I, I actually like it. I like it a lot. Yeah, she's giving me the runaround, but that's the whole point is to, uh, is to learn the game in bits and pieces and, um, you know, through these quests. Yeah, well, I guess that about does it, folks, because I don't have any steel. And this video is getting kind of long. So I think we're just going to call it quits here. I hope you all enjoyed. And I'm going to watch my little buggies here in unison. Oh, look at them. They're all, they are. They're all flying in unison. Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. And I'm going to put my other bugs down here because I've got some extras from the desert that we don't have yet, which is this little fella. And this little fella. Right? Look at them all. That's quite the variety. I love it. All right, guys and gals. This is truly it. Unfortunately, we didn't get to complete this quest and get our tech, but maybe we'll have some time to do that in the next episode. Um, hopefully, anyway. If not, and this character gets wiped out, then, uh, then we'll just wait until the game is fully released. And then, uh, and then we'll do all the quests. So, all right. We'll see you soon. Have a good night. Bye-bye.